this is Swagata. Welcome to my YouTube channel Learn with Swagata. Through this channel you will learn with me various topics on different subjects. You may be a student, a housewife or a working professional. My channel is for all of you. I am sure you will all be excited to learn with me. So now let's get started. In this series of English grammar tutorials, today my topic is verb. The contents include introduction, the different types of verbs like regular and irregular verbs, transitive and intransitive verbs, main verb, auxiliary verb, modal auxiliary verb and an exercise. Introduction Definition of verb A verb is a doing word. It tells about an action. Example is Peter studies in St. Xavier school. Here studies is a verb as it tells about an action. More verbs are read, eat, move etc. Types of verbs Number 1. Regular and Irregular Verbs Regular Verbs Regular verbs are those verbs to which we can add D, E, D, I, E, D to the base form of verb. Examples are Base form arrive, simple past arrived, past participle arrived. Similarly, call, called, called, marry, married, married. Here we are adding D to the first verb, ED to the second verb and IED to the third verb in the simple past and past participle forms. Irregular verbs These verbs do not have any specific rule for change of the base form. Examples are Group 1 Base form cost, simple past cost, past participle cost. Similarly, cut, 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 hurt, hurt, hurt. Here the base form doesn't change in the simple past and past participle forms. Group 2 Base form bring, simple past brought, past participle brought. Similarly, buy, bought, bought get, got, got. Here, simple past and past participle forms remain same. Group 3 Base form run, simple past ran, past participle run. Similarly, come, came, come. Here, base form and past participle forms remain same. Group 4 Base form be, simple past, was or were, past participle been. Similarly, eat, ate, eaten, drink, drank, drunk, fall, fell, fallen, know, knew, known, speak, spoke, spoken. Here all the three forms are different from each other. We will learn about the conjugation of verbs in my latter videos. Number 2. Transitive and Intransitive Verbs Transitive Verbs 
In these types of verbs, the action of the subject is received by a direct object. Example is, the boy is riding a bicycle. Here, riding is a transitive verb because the action of riding is received by the object bicycle. Intransitive verb. In these types of verbs, the action of the subject is not received by a direct object. Example is, I was sleeping, Sarah is playing in the park. Here the actions of sleeping and playing are not received by any direct object. So, these are intransitive verbs. Number 3 Main verb, auxiliary verb and modal auxiliary verb Main verb This is the principal verb in a sentence. This tells about the action which a subject does. Examples are Eat, sleep, play, run, do, etc. Auxiliary verbs these are used with the main verbs. Examples are Is, was, were, has, have, do, did. Modal auxiliary verb These verbs combine with main verbs to express necessity, possibility, intention or ability. Examples are can, could, may, might, must, will, would, ought, shall, should. Now we will come to an exercise. Here you have to pick out transitive, intransitive, auxiliary and modal auxiliary verbs from the following sentences. Number 1. The cricketer caught the ball. Here, caught is transitive verb. Here the action caught is received by the object ball. Number 2. We must listen to our parents. Here must is modal auxiliary verb and listen is transitive verb. Number 3. She is cooking. Here is is auxiliary verb, cooking is intransitive verb, here the action cook is not received by any object. Number 4. We should pray to God every day. Here should is modal auxiliary verb, pray is transitive verb. Number 5. The students knew all the answers in the examination. Here, knew is transitive verb. Here the action knew is received by the object, all the answers. Number 6. The baby is sleeping quietly. Here is is auxiliary verb. Sleeping is intransitive verb. Here the action sleeping is not received by any object. Number 7. The girl has a beautiful doll house. Here, has is an auxiliary verb. Number 8. We stayed in Chicago for many years. Here, stayed is intransitive verb. Number 9. Please do not sit there idly. Here sit is intransitive verb. Number 10. I always speak the truth. Here speak is a transitive verb. Here the action speak is received by the object the truth.
Thank you for watching. If you have any queries or doubts, please write in the comment section below. If you like my tutorial, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Have a great time ahead. Bye.